Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to show you how to make your very own subscribe animated button just like this. Alright, so to get started, the first thing we want to do is we want to find a subscribe button icon that we can uh, start with. So I'm going, going to subscribe PNG. And we want to search for a PNG file, which is a more compressed than a, like a JPEG file. Um, so there's lots of different options right here that we can see right away. Something more simple. You can choose something more elaborate. And you can even check out some of these sites. They got pretty decent, like freepng.com. They have a pretty decent selection of different subscribe uh, options. So I'm going to download a couple of these right away. And I think they're free to download here. So I'm going to download a couple of these and uh, we'll go from there. All right, so I got a couple things downloaded here that I kind of like, uh, a couple different icons. And what we want to do next is we want to open up Keynote. On the bottom there, you got Keynote. If it's not in your dock, it should be in your launch pad. So you're going to fire up Keynote, new document. And I'm going to start with a white presentation just like this. Open up, and the first thing I do is I just delete the text that they put in there to begin with. The next thing is you want your uh, color fill on your background of your document to be you know, kind of like a green or like a neon green really works well. Uh, either that or I think blue, like a dark blue. You need a blue or green screen here to achieve the effect that you're looking for with iMovie. So now that we have the background that we need, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start and drag in one of these PNG files. And oh, it's a little bit too big right now. So you can just come down here and you can kind of make that the size that you want for your movie. That's probably about what I'm looking for right there. And then I'm also going to bring in one of these other subscribe buttons that I downloaded from the internet. And I really like this one. And yep, that one's going to be too big. So I'm going to have to resize this thing just as I did the other one. Just take it down a little bit. And I think, yeah, probably about something like that is about the size that I want to work with. Now I have two different uh, two different icons that I'm going to insert into my movie. So as opposed to just putting one in there. But I'm going to start with this top one. I want to give it a little bit of a, a shadow on the bottom. I think a curved shadow. I'm going to bring that offset just a little bit more like that. I'm going to do the same here. Curved shadow. And I, yeah, I really like that. It kind of gives it some sort of depth there. So now I want to work on the animation. So I'm going to start with this top icon first. And I'm going to go over up here to animate. I'm going to build in, add an effect. And I'm going to have this one skid in. And we'll look at the preview. Yep, that looks pretty good. I like, I like that skid in. So then we're going to do a... We're going to do an action after it skids in. So we're going to add one more effect. And I think I'm going to have this one... I think I'm going to have it bounce. Yep. So... We are going to look at the build order. 
bounce. And I have the build in. Nope. I want the I want the skid in. So skid in, bounce, put them together here. You can lift these up. Yep, there we go. And we can preview the whole thing. So skid in followed by a bounce. Okay. Now I'm going to come down here to this next bottom subscribe button. And I'm going to build in with a, uh, I think I'm going to do a, a spin in. And I'm going to follow that up with one more action. I'm going to have it do a, I'm going to have it do a jiggle. So I'm going to look at the build order, and I'm going to put all three of these together. There's four items on my build order, and we're going to preview the whole thing. Skid in with the bounce, and then the bottom subscribe icon comes in with, with the jiggle there at the end. So that's exactly what we want there, and that's what I'm looking for. Okay, so now that you have your subscribe icon or any other kind of icon that you want to work with, um, you can go ahead and export. So you're going to go up to File, Export to Movie, and you're going to make this into an export movie here. Um, and you want to save it under uh, 1080p for resolution. And I'm just going to save that right to my desktop. Subscribe icon. All right, so that's going to save to my desktop. And next we can go ahead and insert that into an I. Next we can go and insert that into an I movie. All right, so I have just finished uh, animating my uh, YouTube subscribe button in the Keynote app, and I have just imported that uh, from my desktop into my iMovie app, and it is right here. I've selected uh, a clip that's about five seconds of it that I'm going to uh, overlay into my existing uh, project here. So I'm just going to go ahead and move that down. And you can place this right above any existing uh, media that you already have in here. So I'm going to insert it right about oh, in there. And what you want to do is uh, make sure that this is selected here. And you're going to move over here to uh, the video overlay settings which automatically defaults to cutaway, but you're going to click on that and move down to green, blue screen. You want it green, blue screen. And that's going to get it to where we want it. Uh, and let's just take, take a quick look here and see how uh, this looks under those settings. I'm going to show you how to make your very own subscribe animated button just like this. So that's pretty good. Uh, one other thing I wanted to add in just to give the video a little bit more character is I downloaded a mouse clicking audio file here, which I kind of want to put in right around the same time the subscribe uh, icon comes in and jiggles. So I'm going to mark that spot, and then I'm going to take my mouse click audio and put that right at the same spot there. So I get the audio of a mouse click uh, as it plays. So let's, let's go ahead and see how that looks and sounds. Subscribe animated button just like this. All right, so that pretty much wraps it up, guys. Uh, super easy, really uh, not too difficult. Uh, you just want to search for the uh, PNG image of whatever uh, icon you're looking for, 
and then uh, using the Keynote app it's pretty easy to uh, place those in over a green background and even animate them to move and then you can overlay them straight into your iMovie video so I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and uh, I'm gonna be bringing some more your way a couple different iMovie tutorials in the future so uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and uh, thanks guys